I'm a drum guy. And I'm a black guy, so this so this works out. This works. Yeah. We could share wings at the restaurant and everybody be happy. We can do that. From downtown St. Paul, this is Posted Up with Ryan Carter. Welcome back for another episode of Posted Up. We have a special one here today, my guest Matt Dumba. Shout out to Hot Ones, which you've seen before, the show. Yeah, I like that show, actually. Yeah. yeah. All right, so let's start off. This is just a honey mustard. I've got the honey, the Carter's honey from the backyard hive. That's real nice. So speaking of honey mustard, what is it that you've got? Is it a Mustang? Mm -hmm. I actually got a honey mustard Mustang, which I recently just sold. Do you still have any classic cars? Do you throw the top? I do. I have a 68 Bronco. Ended up building that with my billet dad and junior. He owned a custom auto body shop. It was my first car I ever bought at 17 years old when I when I signed with the Wild actually that summer. It's still the summer car. Yeah, and it's a summer car. This one I think is gonna be soft. Again, this is for me. Scotch bonnet hot sauce. Scotch bonnet. I can already taste the heat and I'm already not happy. <laughs> I was just gonna say you're gonna be all right. <laughs> I like that one. Little spicy. Little kick. Yeah. So speaking of cars, April Fools is around the corner. Remember the great April Fools the post-it note? That little uh, April Fools Day prank for for Ecker. Probably posted a couple thousand. A couple thousand. <laughs> notes. Yeah. We covered it. We color coordinated it pretty good. It too. looked um, it looked yeah, unbelievable. We put the fourteen yeah. on, on the on the hood. So any other good pranks that you like to pull or you know, memorable ones or? You know, on the road. So we trek into the hotels. They have the they have the keys at the front desk. You grab your key, you go up. Moose ended up being being back there, so I got off the bus real quick. And so I went and I, I snuck into his room, hid my bag in the in the shower, and then they have that like wardrobe where he hangs his stuff. And I know Moose is like a proper Italian man, like gets to his room and he's got to hang, <laughs> hang up, up all his clothes. So he like comes in the room and. He like lays down on the bed for a bit and starts and starts going on his phone. I'm like, ah, he comes over and opens up the thing. I jump out. I get had the camera on it. <laughs> and like, I'm lucky he didn't hit me. <laughs> Let's bring on the heat. Now we're getting into something that I recognize. This is habanero. Habanero, yeah. habanero pepper. On the back, it says it is just simply hot. And this one's a little bit more like, like Tabasco-y kind of hot. You know, not like burning your face off, but. No. You know, it's running a little bit. Oh, yeah. just... <laughs> <laughs> I'll start sweating my brow. My hair is gonna look just all disheveled. It's all disheveled. I like those. I I'd probably order those. That one's good. I like that a lot. I'm gonna take my first sip. We're or also not. We're also doing no uh, no ranch or blue cheese here. No, no. I'm not a dipper. Are you dipper? I do, I do ranch sometimes. Okay, that's little, okay. Little touch, blue cheese. Little touch. No, no Some blue cheese. Some people are passionate about blue cheese or ranch. I'm Greener, not Greener's a strictly a blue cheese guy. Wings, pizza, I, I don't know. I can't wrap my head around it. You were 55, you get, uh, Tony DeCosta gives you 55, yeah, the disrespect to get, to get me 55. Actually, it wasn't disrespect. The way I was told from, from Tricky that it actually was a gesture of, this is a good number, 55, Schultz, -y. you know, yeah, you do get those numbers in the 50s, but also is like a respectable number around here. So we didn't even realize like, what it would look like on a nameplate <laughs> until we until we saw it in the dressing room. <laughs> so 24, why 24? You finally got to pick. It's nothing to do with hockey. Kobe and one of my favorite players in the NFL growing up, Champ Bailey. I thought it was because you're a team guy and a case of beer has 24 beers and 24 you, just points. One, you just give one to everybody. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> one for everybody. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> You just flip this on me. Make sure you check out part two of this Posted Up episode right here on the Minnesota Wild YouTube page as things get even more spicy with Matt Dumba. I'm not afraid to play through pain. 